Good morning, Kathy. I've been getting your medicine wheel kit together and I wanted to show you a little bit about how I do this. Um, but first of all, this is white sage from my backyard. So I'd like to sage our work together, do a little clearing and cleansing and blessing. And these are the seven boxes um, that I have left from this project that I started when I was about 44. And the reason that I created these is that I've been working individually with people. And also, when I traveled, I wanted something that I could take with me that would make doing the medicine well work very easy. And I would have everything I need. And I'm just the kind of person who loves to make kits. So it seemed to be a natural progression to make a medicine wheel kit. And uh, so my students have used these and there's probably, oh, not more than, I don't think 36 or 48 of these all together. So you're getting one of the last eight. And uh, you'll open it up and see the medicine wheel and where you are on the wheel, which I believe is 52. So you are in the Northeast Design and Choreography of Energy. I've been thinking a lot about what that means. And also you're protecting the inner fire right now. And uh, after, at 54, you move into the center of the wheel, which will bring you into a, another exciting new time of your life. Um, and this is pretty much the complete kit, and I'm going to go ahead and send it off to you. It's missing the aroma balm. The reason being I ran out of this stuff that um, I've been using, and I made an attempt to make a new special blend for you, and I don't like it. So um, if you'll bear with me, I'm going to work on that because I, I know the aroma that I want to send to you with the medicine we all hear and it's cedar and sage and but in here you'll find all the stones that you're going to be working with and I'm not going to lay out the wheel I'm just going to show you the stones right now um, beautiful crystal uh, one of the feedbacks I got from my early kits was that the people didn't like that the crystals were low quality. So I, I go to my favorite stores, Planet Earth Rising, and my friend Susan Stream, who, uh, who sells wonderful things online too. So the crystals are, are quite special. And these I've handpicked from uh, a little shop called Ology down in the Sacramento old town so I uh, it's they're beautiful and just to take some time and work with the stones and that's what this is really really all about taking some time to work with the stones the next thing you're going to find is a black pouch and this is your storytelling pouch, and you'll be guided to be picking things up uh, during this lunar cycle, small things that are meaningful to you and putting in, in here, and at the end we'll hear your story. And you'll find one lapis bead, um, and everybody who has gotten a kit from me since I did this work in Livermore in uh, gosh, 1986, um, has gotten their storyteller pouch with a bead. So this connects you to all the other people who have been doing this work. And then this is sort of old school, <laughs> CDs, <laughs> but can, well, you can't, you can listen to this while you're driving, but not on this one. Um, I'm going to put these so they're available on iTunes because that's the next way to go here. But this is Songs for the Circle and it's myself and a couple very good medicine sisters and brothers singing uh, Songs for the Four Directions. 
and this is a meditation around the medicine wheel that's about 20 minutes um, that I did in July of 2001 with my medicine daughter, sister, Shannon Wells, who's still doing this work. And uh, then there is the sage bowl. And you just put a little bit of sage in there. And I like that because you can bless yourself and bless the circle and just cover it up. Uh, so it doesn't get too odiferous and the sage is very good for igniting and then you get the other stuff going and the four herbs are sage, cedar, sweet grass and lavender which is for blessing and cleansing and clearing and love and all those good things and uh, a candle and I got these wonderful um, stone candle holders when I was in Colorado so this is my last of the stone candle holders. Um, matches to light these things. I gotta stick that on. <laughs> I ran out of the other side, so you'll forgive me. I'm putting pieces together. This is a really great compass because some of the feedback in the past was my compasses were, were not accurate. So um, this is a sweet compass. And I have one on my key ring and you always need to know where your directions are, as you well know. And then, of course, the book, which this is all based on. And if you just flip through it, there's a lot of blank pages, but it's really an interactive book. So it's, uh, it's a journal. Read this and, and fill in your places. And in the back of the book are these uh, cue cards. So look for those. There's one for each direction and a couple just for the journey. So when you're working on the direction, you can have that, that cue card out. And the piece that you're not getting right away is the aroma balm, um, because I have some ideas as to what I want to do with that. And I don't want to hold up sending this to you. And I'm sure you won't mind. Um, getting two packages from me. So this is for medicine work along the road. Oh, another thing I was thinking of adding, um, and I think I'll just do this and you can let me know how wonderful this is. But uh, how wonderful is that? And I was thinking of just sending one as part of the kit, but it's very nurturing to have two. So I'm adding this to you for your kit for the first time. And now I'll have to go get some more at the music shop, which is just fine with me. So you can see that this is a very handmade kit. And uh, these will be the last ones that I make like this. And we'll see what happens next with the project. I just wanted to show you one more thing. In the process of uh, setting up your kit, I went and got all my stuff out to take a look at what I had. And I found these, which are the very first stones from Wright's Beach that led me to set up, to set up the kit this way. So I, am, I have just been very, very blessed. And I'm delighted to share this with you. So, Omatakuyasin, happy journey, sister. Ho. Oh. The earth is our mother. We must take care of her. The earth is our mother. We must take care of her. Hey, yana ho, yana hey, yan, yan. Hey, yana ho, yana hey, yan, yan. Her sacred ground we walk upon With every step we take Her sacred ground we walk upon With every step we take Hey, yana ho, yana hey, 